Welcome to our championship week preview. I'm Andy Katz along with Seth Greenberg. The ACC tournament once again held at the Greensboro Coliseum. And Seth, uh, this one will have maybe a bubble team or two, possibly, but uh, some teams have played their way out. You could have a lot of locks here going into this week, so a lot of teams playing for seeding. Which team do you think has the most at stake? I think the Pitt people and the Syracuse people, they're going to be looking for restaurants coming from Madison Square Garden. Well, you've been in Greensboro, yeah. so you can give but, some advice. But, but the team, to me, that has the most at stake is University of Pittsburgh. If you think about Pitt's resume right now, they have one win against the field, and that's against the Stanford team that is probably right on that cut line. This is a Pitt team that survived winning at Clemson, coming back from down five. They're a very good basketball team. They take care of the basketball. They don't turn it over. They're physical defensively, but I think they've got to find a way to win at least two games in the ACC tournament. Well, if they do that, they're in the top part of that bracket as the five seed. That would mean if the seeds hold, they would be playing number four, North Carolina. Top part of that bracket is number one, Virginia. Bottom part is Syracuse and Duke, and that's where I think we're going to find your player to watch. Well, I, to me, the player to watch is Jabari Parker. The way he played the other day against North Carolina, he was dominating, and dominating a lot of different ways. Dominating in transition, dominating in isolation. He shot the three. He got to the offensive glass. He single-handedly won that game against North Carolina. This is a player that each and every week, he starts to do a little bit more, but the amazing stat to me, in, since the first four games in the ACC, 77% of his shots have been in the paint. He's attacking and making plays. All right, so I've established at the top part of the bracket, Virginia the one, Carolina the four, bottom part is Syracuse as the, as the uh, two, excuse me, Duke as the three. Who's your pick to win it? I like Duke. I think they have most shot makers. I think right now that they're playing at a high level. I think the win against North Carolina set a statement to the rest of the league. And when Parker's playing that well, and then all of a sudden you get some – uh, contributions from Plumlee. You get some contributions from Neil Jefferson. Quinn Cook makes a shot or two, and then Rodney Hood. We, we get so caught up in Parker, we forget about how good Hood is. You're talking about a team with two potential lottery picks. All right, the championship game for the, um, the excuse me, the ACC tournament, Sunday afternoon, 1 o'clock Eastern time on ESPN at the Greensboro Coliseum. Keep it right here on ESPN.com for all our championship week coverage.